For thousands of miles, a wave has a perfectly regular undulating shape. Then as the wave nears the shore, it rears up into a crest just before it breaks. Something has caused it to change. And essentially what happens is, as it comes in towards the shore, it feels the presence of the beach right. that much more. And there is suddenly a great difference between what is happening at the top of the wave and what is happening at the bottom of the wave. Right. Theoretically, what that does is that the, the, the wave at the top wants to move faster than the wave at the bottom, and that's what's causes this overturning. Oh, the, right. the speed of the wave is dependent upon the depth. And for the most part, out in the ocean, the depth is so deep, so it's all, it it's all it's moving, all moving at, the at the same speed. At the same speed. But when you, right. come, when you come towards the shore... The bottom slows down for some reason. So, so the bottom has such an impact all of a sudden that the, the change in the height is crucial. I was curious to see what happens when the energy of a wave dissipates. With the help, once again, of Professor McIntyre's rubber ducts. Down there, it's mostly the energy which is moving. Well, the energy is going much faster. See how much faster the crests are oh, I than see. the yes, yeah. ducks. That slow drift will take them close to the beach and watch carefully from now on. Oh, yeah. That duck, look, suddenly right. it gets swept all the way up to the beach. So Now, that's where the wave motion becomes, as it were, water motion or energy propagation. So when it, when it curls over there, yes. that is, you're saying then it ceases to be just the energy that's moving and the water does actually move. I mean, is it basically that you're, you're trying to conserve the energy, that the energy's got to go somewhere and that it's got to grab the water, basically, isn't it? Not much energy reflects back out, so most of it has to accumulate. That's why you get the sudden violence of the wave breaking. Right. Look at that, I love that. Yeah. It's a wonderful visualisation of gentle wave motion becoming violent wave motion, isn't it? It is. Yeah, you can suddenly, up there, see it get really... It's vertical and then falls over. Yes. 